This morning, some former soldiers are preparing to experience a special moment. An honor flight is taking veterans from the Nashville area to Washington, D.C. What an exciting time for them and everybody with them. New Channel 5's Hannah McDonald's live at the airport this morning. Such a cool morning out there, Hannah. Yes, and this energy had so, this group had so much energy, clearly more than I do, when they were here this morning with us at about 5 o'clock. Their flight takes off at 7.15. They're going to need all that energy today because it's a long, packed day, but they are ready to see the war memorials in Washington, D.C. when their flight does take off here very soon. They're flying on a Southwest flight to Washington, and this is all organized by the Honor Flight of Middle Tennessee. World War II, Korean War, and some Vietnam veterans will be making this trip, about 28 in total, and it is all free for them. Today, they will visit the war memorials as well as the Marine Corps Iwo Jima Memorial, the Air Force Memorial, and they will witness the changing of the guard at Arlington National Cemetery. I talked to a 92-year-old named Bud Dawes. He lives in Hendersonville, and he still works for an oversized towing company. He told me what this flight means to him. Really, this, this flight actually is just dedicated to my son that I lost, and that's one of the things to go to Washington to the, my, the wall up there. But to all the young people nowadays coming up, just keep your nose clean. Uh, just God bless America and take care and be careful. Always an honor to talk to people like Bud. Today they will be getting back at 10.15, so they are packing this all into one day. It is the 21st year for this honor flight organization, and in all of those years, they've flown about 600 former soldiers to our nation's capital to see the memorials. Live at the airport, I'm Hannah McDonald, News Channel 5.